Hello everyone! Welcome back to 4 stars only episode 3, an account where we only play with 4 stars. It has been a hot minute since I've been on this account. This is the first episode I've recorded since releasing the first two episodes of 4 star only and I am blown away. I didn't expect this many people to like this series but people do. I think at the time of recording this, I'm almost at 500 subscribers, which is a goal I didn't think I would meet this early. I am just incredibly grateful for everybody who's decided to watch so far, and all the lovely comments you have left for me. As you can see, well, at the moment there's no banner because it's about two hours off maintenance, but I don't have any prepa gems. <laughs> We'll be getting some from the maintenance though, which would be nice, but I'm really gonna have to find some more Pure Gems so I can roll for more 4 stars. I've got a lot of questing to do, so that's gonna take up a lot of my time. I've gotta do the Archon quests and a few of the other ones as well. I wanna progress the story so we can unlock more content and therefore get more, more stuff. We have the Stellar Reunion, but the good thing is, is we get loads of prima gems. Look at this! A hundred just for logging in? Yes please. We can't really use these yet, but they may come in handy in the future, as we've got two weeks left at the Stellar Reunion. I really want to get to at least AR20 because the Liyue Lantern Rite is coming up in about a week. I really want the four star Liyue characters, so I'm just gonna start doing the Icon Quest, so I can progress because I can't even do daily commissions at the moment. I don't even know when daily commissions come out, but I would really like them. So I think currently I'm gonna put Hazel as our main DPS, Zhang, Ling, Zingcho as sub DPSs, Noelle as sort of a healer, shielder, and buffer. I think that's a pretty good team so far. I know that we won't be able to build Hazel, but I think by the time we get there we're gonna have a bigger roster of characters to use before we need to build Hazel, so this is fine for now. Venti! Again, too bad I can't get him because he's a 5 star. I don't even have Vindy on my main account, but I kind of want him, but he always comes out when I want someone else. No, there's chests here. I know there's chests here. Last time, I didn't get any of the chests. So, I want to see if I can find them. Can I just walk in? Do I get to keep the chest? Aha, uh -huh, keep the chest. Maybe I can just sneak. No, no, no. I'm gonna get it. I don't care if I have to be kicked out hundreds of times. I'm gonna get all the chests here. I think this is all of them. Let me just have another look. Ooh, I almost missed that one. Alright, I think that's all of them. Because you can't go back for the chests once you got them. I swear if I missed a chest. If I missed a chest... I'm going to be so mad. <laughs> oh, Diluc! <gasps> I almost forgot that Diluc was a 5 star. I have to remember not to use Diluc. I have to remember not to use Diluc. I have to re I have to remember not to use Diluc. I wish there was a 3 star or something skin we could have of the Traveler. So like items that we could put on the Traveler like a mask or a fee fox mask that we had in in Azuma in the festival. Something like that. That would be so fun. Oh, and the crown from the Aranaras as well. It's nice having a character that has 100% elemental uptime. This is so we get good artifacts. Well, not even good artifacts, just higher star artifacts. It's going to be quite difficult. So having Hezo is pretty good when it comes to that. Hazo is so fun to play. I've never really played Hazo before. So just like fighting with him is just so different from the other catalysts. 57 damage, guys. We're getting into the high numbers now. No, move, squirrel. No, Guoba, what? Torch the chest, not the squirrel. I had someone ask me why 
won't I use the national team? And I assume a lot of people might be thinking, well, if you're testing out to see if four star characters are powerful, doesn't the national team basically say they are? Doesn't the national team basically confirm that it's easy peasy just to use four star only characters? But in my opinion, obviously it's a challenge. I also wanted to use some more underrated characters. I can use all three of them as long as they're not together because I think it'll just be boring as well. I think it'll be boring if I put so much work into this and it's just like, right, I'm just gonna use Zhangling, Zincho, Bennett, and Chong Yoon when it was just basically the old national team. And I think that it'd be nicer to give some other characters the spotlight, to be honest. You know what character I really want to main? Yenfei. My first ever main in Genshin was Yenfei. She kind of got replaced when I rolled for Ayaka. I just sort of grew apart from Yenfei. I feel like I've done a bit of an injustice to Yenfei. I think this will be a good chance to redeem myself. Another thing about the national team is a lot of people say, well, if you're banning the national team, why not ban all teams that could be meta, like Hyper Blue team and other teams that are very meta? I think the national team is on another level because the national team has been used throughout the entirety of Genshin's life cycle. So one of the most popular teams at the start of Genshin Impact was Chong Yoon, Zhang Ling, Sing Cho, and Bennett. It's still more significant, and I think a lot of people have seen it before. And I just want to make content varied and interesting because a four-star Hyper Bloom team could be really good because the majority of Hyper Bloom teams used in the Spiral Abyss have at least one five-star in them. The majority of people who complete the Spiral Abyss do not use teams of all four stars. We're done! Just before the servers go down for maintenance! Now I just have to get to adventure rank 18. Oh, we unlock commissions. There we go. Things are about to get a lot easier. And we're back! New patch means new test runs! Oh, and they're all four stars. We don't have to do anything. Let's try, let's try. Whoa! I'm sorry. That was so cool. I need him. I need him on my account. I'm so happy that they're doing unique four stars. And I just hope that Gaming doesn't become underrated. Because I haven't actually watched any reviews of him. I've just sort of skimmed through them. Barbara, Zhang Ling, and Lisa. Let's see how this goes. This is meant to showcase Nahida. So you might be thinking... Well, maybe in the trials you can just use five studs if it's easier. No, we're, we're committing to this. Ah, uh, I really want to try out Zhao Yun, but I'm gonna have to wait. Oh, Gaming's in this one as well. It's another Gaming trial. Let's just pretend it's another Gaming trial. Ah, uh, he's so cool. I'm sorry, I'm just freaking out over this guy. We are going to have to try and get Gaming, guys. If not, we could get some more Constellations of Noel, which... I don't know if we really need constellations this early, but you know, I think Noelle's gonna be used for a long time, so it might be good to get summoned. But I also think that I want to roll on the standard as well once I do get Garming, because obviously a lot of people say, oh, don't use standard characters because the limited five star characters aren't on those banners. In my case, I don't really want any of those five stars. And I think the standard banner has a lot better variety. Ooh! Ooh, we get a limited fate. That's cool. We also got a pile of gems and a new name card. Pretty. That's cute. Ooh, I didn't realize I could buy two fates. What's her pity looking like, actually? Five? No, six. How many do we even have? Let's see. How many? So we have three of these. Ooh, that's nine. We can wish for a four star on a limited banner. Should we do that? Let's do that. Hopefully a new four star in his roster and not <laughs> Noel again, but we'll see. I don't want to wish in his banner because if I get Zhao Yun, I will, I will want to roll for her on my other account. I am tempted. <laughs> anyway, I need to stop talking about five stars and four star on the accounts, please. All right, let's go. Let's see what we get. Ooh. Early, early. F Barra's Distinguished Scholar Award. This is the Sumerian Puzzlers Elite. They talk now. I don't know how to feel about that. No, we got Farah's on instead of Garmin. Right, we're gonna we're gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going. A load of nothingness. One of these, and then I can get one equate as well. Farah's on 
something might come in useful later. I'm thinking everyone is a good thing. Right, well, I guess we need to talk Ryan for some more. If you look at it from this angle, it looks like Hazel has fox ears. It's all coming out now. I forgot how sus Hazel's voice lines were. Maybe we should avoid using Hazel to open them now. We're gonna have to try and ascend our character soon. We don't, I don't want to get wrecked by the bosses. I got gaming. I have made a mistake every single YouTuber makes at one point. I forgot to press record on the video. Okay, let's backtrack. Let's backtrack. Let me let me tell you the story. As you can see, Gaming's now on my account because when I thought I pressed record, I didn't. Anyway, we got him straight after the lines roll. You won't see it because it needs to update it. And then we started ascending all my characters and I was talking about how much I loved Gaming. Oh no. Oh well. And it happens sometimes. It happens sometimes. I was praising him and I was asking you guys if you had pulled Gaming yet and what your experience were with him and what teams you would recommend for Gaming. I ascended Noelle. I got some Valbraise for her. You miss so much. I am in love with Gaming right now. Note to self, remember to record. If you like these videos and want to see more, please consider subscribing. We are almost at a thousand subscribers now. So if you want to see more, please consider it. I think our account is one of the luckiest accounts in Genshin. Well, maybe not the luckiest account, but I do feel reasonably lucky considering it's a four star only account. We have some really good four stars. I think now what I'm going to do is I don't really, I don't think I need any more constellations. I'm probably just going to go for as many characters as possible. It's good to have a variety before we start wishing for upgrades. Oh, I forgot. We have five wishes. Tomorrow it resets because it's the 1st of February. Yes! Four star! Four star! Who are we gonna get? What are you gonna get? Goro! That could be a Geo team in the making. That's really good. We could use him with Noelle. Good, good. We're getting some variety. We are we are getting some variety. First resin. Level 17. One more level to go. I have a solution to this problem. I think it is time to make our way down to Liwe Harbor. A little change of scenery would help us get there. We can start leveling up our Geoculuses. Gets an extra rank as well because we don't need that many. I'm not sure how many we need for the first level of Geoculuses. How do I get this without using Traveler's Constructs? Do I just need to use like a tall guy? Um, oh wait, hold on. I literally have go go go. Yes, cheating at the game. Get in. Now, how many do we need to get rewards? Two. Well, that works. And we get some stamina too. Great, amazing. This is exactly what we need. We go, Catherine. Thank you. Almost there. I mean, those are a little legendary chest around here, right? I swear there's a legendary chest around here. There we go, see? Luxurious chest. I think there's a precious chest in the harbor. There we go. This is just an awkward way to get a chest. Hey, I want my rewards. There we go. No! That was so bad, he transformed into a mountain. And there we go! Adventure rank 18. Now I can go do the rest of the monster quest. No Primo gems, unfortunately. Just resin. Ugh, who needs resin, am I right? Who needs resin these days? Let's actually level you up. I'm a bit scared you're gonna be a bit too... Bit too weak. Let's still do a two. Let's do twenty-five. So I'd like to get everyone up to the same kind of level. There we go. I want you to all be the same level. I don't want anyone to be over under leveled. Then it'll cause very uneven distribution. This should help a little bit. I'm loving up all my characters again, just because I think you might be a bit unleveled. Here we go, we'll get everyone to 30. Right, let's fight the Valen. Finally, this is taking me way too long. <laughs>
It's probably all been cut out in editing, but this has literally taken me about six hours. Genshin is a very long game. We're not even through the prologue yet. Uh oh, can't use Venti. I don't think I have to use Venti. I have not fought the Valor in so long. Come and go. Come here, big overblown dragon. Try not to use Venti by mistake. Oh no, I fell off! I have no idea to fight him. He's so annoying. This is the most awkward angle. I can never get it right. So oh, gaming. Good damage. Give me Anagamana. Okay. Well, at least I don't have to use animal for it. Go, hello. Energy recharge wire. This would be very useful with Venti, but oh well. We'll keep going. What the heck? Um, I don't... Was I in the fallen or? <laughs> what was going on? Aha! Finally, that took way longer than I wanted it to. <laughs> Not using Venti was actually quite difficult. <laughs> More difficult than anything because we didn't have any bow characters, so I had to wait for my turn to hit the Valen. <laughs> it took a while to get his health down because my characters just aren't quite there yet. <laughs> so that was interesting. Done. Right. So I should have got a couple of Primo gems from doing all that. And then in my book, there should be... And we can get one of those. And now we can get Barbara. Yay! This should be pretty good for healing. Barbara's the best Hydro healer that we have. So that's pretty good. Let's see how many what gems we have 290 so only one intertwined fate however the starter since change has opened again it's good to have a bit of intertwined we can at least use them let's see if we got anything nope nope come on give me content it will not give me content unfortunately so thank you guys so much for watching four stars only episode three we did a lot of stuff we got through nine different adventure ranks and now we're on to the Liwa Archon quest. Next time I think I'm going to try and build the characters I have to the best of my ability. Obviously we can't really build all of them properly but just getting them a bit further than they are right now is our goal. Try and get some Prima gems so we can pull for more characters. I'm just happy to have fun with you guys so thank you guys so much Remember to like and subscribe and I'll see you all in the next video.